Oh, Hawaii is just magical in so many ways. And of course, it's like a foraging paradise. There's like desert and jungle and forest and so many beautiful ways of tasting the land. <laughs> My name is Sunny Savage, and I am a wild food forager. Oh, one of my favorites, it's java plum. The leaf is um, just got a beautiful aroma. I love it soaked in water, and then it makes your water kind of flavor like uh, grapefruit a little bit. So spiny amaranth, I would say, is my favorite green. It's like spinach on steroids. I mean, it has so much more nutrient density to it. And so, yeah, we just eat the leaf. The root is also edible. Today, we're gonna soak them in cream and then do actually a savory dish with them. You can saute them up, so they're pretty versatile. I prefer them soaked in water or um, cooked. I really love the feeling of abundance that having so many beautiful foods um, provides. And it's not only food. When you're a forager, then you start like, oh, there's medicine and something that I can make a basket with or whatever, you know. But I always really try and focus on the invasives because those are what we find in most abundance in our ecosystem. And so it's kind of this like, eating healthy by harvesting the wild foods aspect, but then also really helping the land by stopping the further spread of the invasives. Strawberry guava, java plum, butterfly gingers, the spiny amaranth, and the Spanish needles. So those are the five problematic invasives. I personally feel like the invasives are sacred plants from where they came from. It's just there's a lot of vilification of invasives. So I kind of still practice some of those protocols of like tuning into the plant, asking permission before I ever harvest, and only taking what I need. I don't need the whole thing. Because you can harvest and you don't have to worry about that over harvesting, but it still has to be respectful. It's a living being. Foraging is more than just eating food that's highly nutrient dense and amazing for your body. It's really this storied eating that connects in a little bit deeper and you can't go to the store and buy it. So it's really divinely um, nourishing for the body and the soul and the mind.